Hi guys, how are you? I hope you're good, good. I hope you're fine. I hope you are in good health despite the coronavirus. So today, what do I want to talk about? I want to share a little bit of information about the coronavirus because I learned about it today and it really put me in panic mode. I was a bit scared, but after sleeping over it and I'm like, you know what, there is hope. So the hope is that we share the information with one another, whatever we know about this virus, we can share it across to every other person. I want to talk about what I was able to find out, what I was able to learn, what I was able to know, so that together we can be safe. Because that is Sinobuntu. You know what that means? Sinobuntu. If you don't know, you don't know. If you know, you know. Good for you. What is the coronavirus? The coronavirus, it's a... Um, it belongs to a family of viruses, obviously, but most importantly, it's not an airborne virus or an airborne disease or whatever it is, because this virus, it is about 600 microns. So because it's about 600 microns, it is quite a lot for it to float in air. So it doesn't have buoyancy, because it doesn't have buoyancy, then it cannot float in air, and as a result, it is not an airborne disease. No! I sound so smart! It's a disease that you know it can, it happens from here it all happens here come on, your face so avoid touching your face with your hands okay so yes it's a virus it became prominent in 2019 that is why it's, a, it's called a COVID-19 so the 19th was 2019 although I'm sure you know about it only in 2020 that it's fine don't kill yourself it's been there you know it's not new if you thought it's new it's not new it's been there, but it became more permanent in 2019. It started in China. But although it started in China, it has become more prominent in Europe, in the Europe continent. Europe is the most infected continent with the virus. On that note, we are able to know what the virus is. It belongs to the family of virus. The symptoms, you get like your coughing, your sneezing, you get high temperatures, your body becomes weak. Um, yeah, so it, it, it's not like a normal flu, you know, when you get flu, you go, you've got a headache, your body's tired, you're coughing, you sneeze. But at this age and time, if you feel unhealthy, if you feel you're coughing too much, you sneeze, do not take it for granted. Please visit a doctor, okay? Because if you don't know that you have it and you have it, it's very easy for your little baby to have it, it's very easy for everybody in your environment to get it. So if you're feeling sick right now, please go to a doctor so they can check you and be sure that you do not have the coronavirus. Now, how can you get the coronavirus? Remember, it's not airborne, so but you can get it. Infected person sneezing or coughing around you. It's very easy for you to get it by touching contaminated surfaces. Okay, and on that note, the virus can leave on any surface between two hours or more, you know? So if you come across any surface and you touch it with these things, and you use these things you call the hands, and you come across here, babes, you're gonna get the virus, okay? And also, when you get the virus, you wouldn't know immediately when you talk about coronavirus. It takes about 48 hours to 72 hours. If you don't know what that is, it's two, to three days, two to three days for you to for the symptoms to start showing. Do you worry that nobody is safe from your little toddlers, from your little baby who cannot even say mama or papa, to your older gogos who cannot even do things for themselves? Everybody can have this virus. So, guys, please be safe. Please take care of your family, your loved ones. Please wash your hands off how can we avoid this virus this is the most important thing because it's already here we are living with it number one i would say is sharing information from what i got was that it became so prominent in the europe continent because people were not aware of it people had little knowledge of what it was about so please share information share what you know with your friends your loved ones your family and on that note don't just share any kind of information please share information which is useful share information which is valuable share information which will benefit somebody because in this time we're going to have a lot of crooks coming around trying to scheme us trying to do conja conja ways find a find a ways to extort people please be careful with the information you get 
and please check the information you share before sharing it it should make sense to you before you can give it out to another person so on that note i'm sharing my information because it made sense to me and i think it's going to be useful to you it's going to be valuable to your family and it may save your life so on that note how and no, number two way of avoiding this virus guys use hand sanitizers as much as you can sanitize your hands do not touch your face if you haven't washed this teach your kids how to wash their hands wash in between wash between wash 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 teach your kids how to wash their hands teach people to be safe if you can afford for a mess and you can find it because i heard they're finished please get one if um yeah just keep your environment clean number three avoid overcrowded areas avoid using the lift i know some of us are very lazy to use the stairs okay this is the moment where see zojima we're gonna lose some pounds okay avoid the leaves and if you must use the leaf please do not press the buttons with this do not use this to press the button use your knuckle to select the floor level you want to go to use your knuckle to select the floor level you want to go to but if you can avoid overcrowded spaces do not use the taxis here's baby if you can avoid it do not use it but if you must use it please and if you feel unsafe in a taxi have your cloth with you or your tissue and just cover your face do not be ashamed you know with us people we've got this thing that we like to intimidate and be like oh when are you thinking no 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 no, baby now is not the time to please people now is the time to save yourself okay to save your being because you still want to be here when this whole coronavirus is over so if you must use a taxi please have a cloth and you know protect yourself avoid touching you know people you know if if, if you can just you know drop your money from one person to another as that you know use that avoid the leaf but if you must use the leaf do this um another overcrowded space avoid the malls um another overcrowded space you know you know avoid crowded people as much as possible or crowded as much as possible number three drink a lot of water be hydrated stay hydrated be hydrated number four what is number four i don't know what number four is avoid me and avoid sharing stuff and on that note guys please be safe share information and if you must open a door from what i heard you can you know use your able avoid using your hands to touch things as much as you can because this is the most important thing in this whole thing your hands avoid using your hands to touch a lot of things if you can use your elbow to open the door you know use your elbow to open the door Christmas. come on man guys we are in the developed age come and just dab it and that's it you know give it a dab and you sneeze in that and the rest of us we're going to be covered and go ahead see it see your coughing everywhere no please dab it and <coughs> dab it and sneeze okay yes no please dab it and <coughs> dab it and sneeze okay yes and on that note please take off your little ones your older ones and most importantly guys i think we must pray okay if you've never prayed if you've never been a prayerful person if you've never prayed if you've never been a prayerful person but i know for a lot of people this for some people this may be a time where you want to doubt that where is god but if you're doubting that where is god there is a song by cassie j which says if god be for me who can be against me just go listen to that song google it search it listen to it and i bet you your soul is gonna be revived you know what i mean so on that note guys please stay safe share useful information avoid touching places with your hands as much as possible before you touch your face wash your hands use hand sanitizer um yeah avoid sharing stuff if you must use a taxi be safe do not be ashamed of how you feel because it's okay to be scared it's okay to panic because babes we've got one life like one life and if it's gone it's if you're gone you're gone 
if you're here you're here and on that note i hope you keep safe i hope you pray for your loved ones i hope to see you i hope to hear from you when this whole thing of coronavirus is over because i believe it's going to be over do not panic you know talk to people if you're scared if you're worried talk to people um because depression is real just from this thing you can become depressed and you know talk to someone and yeah be safe um be careful avoid traveling if you can be a messed up here because a lot of us have like we had like plans we were like you know at 2020 the start of another decade since oh, we're gonna bloom like the flowers but corona was like baby girl kisu umoya because you ain't going no way okay but it is what it is it's the world we're living in you can run to nowhere you want to go to europe it's there you can't even travel so you can't do anything so on that note i hope to see you when this whole epidemic is over okay and i hope you see me too but if you don't see me again as whitney houston will always say you know the favorite whitney houston song and i will always i will always love you darling i love you i will always love you i loved you i am in love with you i love you and yes i will always love you bye guys be safe and take care ciao